Okay, Jarrett, um, you know, so the North State is really proud of you. Talk about your roots in Anderson and, you know, just some of your early football memories there. Yeah, so yeah, I grew up in Anderson pretty much my whole life. I was born at Mercy, then grew up in Anderson. Uh, and then I started playing football at the age of like eight. And uh, I was always like a bigger kid, so I kind of had to play uh like two years up so i always was playing like older like my brother i was playing my brother's age and he was he's two years older than me so grew up playing football pretty much my whole life played a lot of sports but mainly focused on football awesome and are you going to be playing um the center position for the 49ers um i mean i could play any position and i think i've shown that like the last six years of college football that i've played um but uh, i think I think that I could play a more interior position, so guard or or center. So I know that um, I could play either, and I know that they need help at at any position. So um, any any place I could come in and and uh, help. Um, you're going to be playing alongside Trent Williams, one of the best tacklers in the NFL. How does that feel? Are you excited to learn from him? Yeah, no, excited to learn from all the all the old veterans, all the old guys that have uh, showed that they could play uh, at, at the highest level that they can and just see what makes them so great and just learn from them and try to imitate them. Yeah, and it looks like in your first two years, you were playing on the left tackle side, and then when you went to USC, you kind of played a little bit on the right side. Do mm -hmm. you have a preference of which side you play on? Uh, neither. No, I've, I've played on, like you said, the right and left side, both guard and tackle. And I have played some center a little bit, so, um, not really. They're both very comfortable, comfortable for me. So I don't really have a preference. Okay. So you're adaptable. Very. Yeah. Yeah. And where do you get your work ethic from? Um, I'd say just my parents. Uh, I mean, my, my dad owns his own automotive shop. So I grew up working on cars, uh, and then my mom is a school bus driver, so more of a blue collared uh, family. So I just grew up, knew how to work hard from a young age, knew like how to make money, how to do things the right, right way, that type of thing. Okay. And you're going from playing in the college to now the biggest league in the world. What are some things you're doing to prepare mentally and physically for that? Yeah, so mentally, um, just like getting in the playbook uh, and learning as as quickly as I can all the different plays and and schemes that I can as quickly as possible. And then physically, I mean, I think that the last six years I've been working towards this goal anyway. So I just continue to to develop physically. You know, always get bigger, stronger, faster, that type of thing. Yeah, and the Niners have been a really good team these past couple of years. And Kyle Shanahan has been really innovative offensively in playmaking. Are you excited to be working with him as well? Yeah, super excited. Yeah, no, he he's one of the greatest coaches in in the league right now. And uh, no, I think that it would be great to get under his wing and, and learn from him and, and Coach Forrester to the offensive line coach and and all the coaches really. What's your advice to them if there was another Anderson High School football player who wants to be like you one day? Yeah, just like going back to the hardworking thing and and uh, finding just finding out what you want to do in life and being super dedicated towards it. Um, if that's it, could be anything. It could be school. It could be sports. It could be any any sport. So just be dedicated to it and work hard for your dreams. Is there anything you want to say to everybody in the North State before you go? Um. I don't know. Uh, I just uh, want to say thank you for all the support that you guys given me. Um, and uh, I think I'm number 62. So look out for number 62 on the football field. So, Yes. Okay, cool. Thank yeah. you so much. We'll be looking out yeah. for you and we'll be cheering for you.